know how every holiday has certain images around it that make you uh, think about that holiday? Like with uh, Christmas, you might think of a, a sleigh or a manger scene. Um, St. Patrick's Day, you might think of four-leaf clovers, things like that. Well, on Valentine's Day, you know, you usually think of hearts and, and love and surprises and sometimes you're overwhelmed, sometimes you're completely underwhelmed, but you know there's usually something about a Valentine's Day that gets all of us. And uh, I know there's this, uh, there's some companies out there where you can call them and contact them and they'll show up at your door and they'll sing at you and it's supposed to be this great surprise because you open your door and all of a sudden these people are just like Whoa! in your face and they sing this song at you. But uh, anyway, well I certainly got a surprise today when I opened my door. But, uh, whatever the intent, this being got stage fright and ran off. And it took me a moment to realize what had happened, and when I did, I screamed my head off and slammed the door because, uh, it was a mouse. We have a mouse, at least one. One mouse. It didn't sing for me, it didn't dance for me, so obviously it didn't come from Cinderella's castle. You know, that would be, that would be something, you know. I'd be okay with that, but this thing, no, 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 no. So, uh, <laughs> while other people are out fine dining and whining and whatever they're gonna do for Valentine's Day, uh, I think we have to wait here for pest control to show up. So, that's our Valentine's Day today. Hey, it's real, folks. Anyway, uh, we've never had mice before, I'll just say that. We do not have a nasty house, especially thanks to our amazing house cleaner. Uh, we, we're not nasty. You know, the garage is a little disorganized, but it's a garage. You just store stuff in there, you know? It's not like it's the pristine epic of fine living in a garage. A garage is a garage, you know? But, oh my gosh, people. Like, okay, yeah, we've never had mice, ever. We, we've seen evidence from former tenants that lived here, and they were nasty people. And there was mice when they lived here, but there has not been a single mouse, to our knowledge, since we've been here, up until Valentine's Day 2017. And I don't know what's so special about this day where they thought, ah, we love it here, let's hide out in the garage. I have no idea. You know, but that thing wasn't going to stay around to give me an explanation. I mean, it just, whew, it took off. I mean, it, it did. It took me a moment to realize what happened because it was so fast, it looked like a darting shadow. Uh, but I realized the only thing that can move that fast is a mouse. Darn mouse. So, all right. I don't even know why I bothered to share that. I think it's because I can't call my mom this early because there's a three hour difference and she'll be really tired. <laughs> and it probably won't be worth her time for me to call to tell her, there's a mouse in my garage. So I guess I'm just blasting this out there to the rest of you because I'm still freaking out. I was panicking. I called up maintenance, you know, and I probably filled with nervous laughter. They probably thought I was a crazy person. So I'm like, hey, there's a mouse in my garage. Hey. You know, no, okay. I didn't really sound like that, but you know, <clears throat> Uh, but you know, it's, oh, ugh, there's a mouse in my garage, get it out of my garage, I don't want it there, it belongs out in the woods with its woodland friends, you know, there's hawks out there, they need to eat them, you know, anyway, <sighs> alright, yeah, Valentine's Day 2017, this is my day, and this is my story, have a wonderful one, you all. Test free.